All right, guys, what we've got next is a 2017 Honda Fury and a new color for this year called matte black metallic. And last year they did a matte gray metallic, which was close to it. And we'll do just a quick walk around and go over some of the features on it. I won't be able to start this one up because it doesn't have gas in it or a charge battery or anything like that. It's fresh out of the crate. We'll start with the engine first. It's a 1,312 cc liquid cooled 52 degree V twin, you know, single overhead cam with three valves per cylinder, and a 38 millimeter throttle body. It makes right at was it 67 horsepower at 4,250 RPMs and 78.9 foot pounds of torque at 2,250 RPMs which helps it put out right at 45 miles per gallon. And a 3.4 gallon fuel tank. And last year they did shave off the passenger seat but you can buy the passenger seat as an accessory if you wanted to add it back on as well as the rear passenger pegs which you can see that normally mount right there of course disc brakes front and rear you got a 200 millimeter wide rear tire and it is shaft drive and as far as suspension goes on you know, the rear it's got a single shock with adjustable rebound dampening and five position spring preload dampening. I mean adjustability, I'm sorry. And up front 45 millimeter front forks. 336 millimeter disc with a twin piston caliper up front and a single piston caliper in the rear. <laughs> Sorry for all the sniffs, the allergies have dropped me crazy with all this pollen, guys. 21 inch front wheel, the 18 inch front or 18 inch rear wheel. It does have a 20, 26.9 inch seat height. 71.2 inch wheelbase. Its curb weight's right at 663 pounds. And Honda's MSRP this year's $10,299 on the standard model like this. And you can get it with ABS as well. That's right at a thousand more. You only have one color option for each. You have candy red for the ABS and then this matte black metallic for the non-ABS. If you want to see a detailed review of the specs, a lot of R&D information stripped down to the frame, stuff like that, I've got a detailed review over at hondaprokevin.com. Thanks for checking out the video, guys. If you would, hit that like button and subscribe new videos every week. Thanks guys.